everyone, it's Emma from The Littlest Lives Rescue back with another video. Today I'll be answering one of the questions I get asked the most about rabbits, which is how messy are they? Come and join me in the shed with our newly rescued giants to find out the answer. What was that? So the first thing you need to know about bunnies is they poo a lot. An average size rabbit will produce 200 to 300 poops per day. These guys I'm cleaning out now are giants and there are four of them so you can imagine what I'm dealing with here. Rabbits produce two different types of poo, pellets which are uniform in size, round and hard which is what you'll mostly see and cecotrophs which are softer, darker and shinier which you won't see as often. Rabbits need to eat cecotrophs in order to stay healthy. Yes, it sounds gross, but it's totally normal for them. They do this because the cecotrophs contain important vitamins and nutrients that they can't get any other way. Usually, they'll eat them straight out of their bottom, so if you find them lying around or stuck to your rabbit's bottom, it could be a sign that your rabbit is unwell, obese or has teeth issues. This is why I always recommend checking your rabbit's bottoms and poops carefully every day. Rabbits are very clean animals in the sense that they will choose one area to go to the toilet in, such as a litter tray, although you will still get some pellets scattered around other areas also. Bearing in mind how many poops rabbits do a day, you'll need to clean their litter trays out regularly, usually once per day, and also sweep up the floor of their accommodation. Plenty of good quality fresh hay is very important for rabbits. Not only should it go in their litter tray, but it should also make up 80% of their diet. Hay is very messy. Even though my bunnies live outside and I keep my hay in the shed, it somehow ends up all over my clothes and my living room floor anyway. Sometimes I even find it in my hair when I'm at work. This is definitely something you need to bear in mind before you get bunnies. Rabbits' natural behaviours include nibbling, foraging, chewing and digging. This means you'll need to provide them with plenty of enrichment, including toys to chew and toss around and digging boxes in order to keep them stimulated and happy. Rabbits' teeth grow continually throughout their life, so they need to chew constantly in order to wear their teeth down. To us humans, this can come across as destructive and naughty, but from the bunny's point of view, they are simply exhibiting their natural behaviour. Providing plenty of enrichment is the best way to discourage destructive behaviour. Bunnies who are bored tend to be more destructive. If you use your imagination, you don't need to spend lots of money. Even a toilet roll stuffed with hay and forage or a large cardboard box with some newspaper inside to rip up can provide hours of fun for a bunny. A piece of apple or willow wood is a great way to tempt them away from nibbling your furniture. Even though rabbits groom themselves and each other, sometimes they need a little extra help from their humans to trim their nails and brush out excess fur especially when they are shedding their winter coats. This can get very messy and you will get covered in fur. So in conclusion, yes, having rabbits can be quite messy and healthy, happy rabbits with plenty of space and stimulation will, in theory, be less destructive. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you again soon.